after eight to five. The judging includes three phases. Number one, symmetry with comparing body types. Number two, muscularity. Now on the stage is the last finalist, 32-year-old J.J. Marsh from Phoenix. Fantastic back development. He's known as being also a very good poser. Really great leg development. Leg biceps and the quadriceps. Needs more calves, though. This is one of the complaints the judges have. Good lat spread, good V-shaped body, good most muscular, but does not have yet the finished body that he should have in order to win this competition. Our last finalist, J.J. Marsh, the all-important pose down is coming up next. Now here he is with a perfect kneeling three-quarter back pose great back development but still needs some calf development and here is going to the mirror which i consider bodybuilder's best friend <laughs> yeah it doesn't lie it tells the truth we'll have more from the arnold schwarzenegger classic coming up in a moment Gentlemen, relax. Now the final moments of the competition, the all-important pose down when the athletes have their He's final chance great. to impress pose the down. judges. This is an area that you really pioneered, Arnold, in your days of competition. Yeah, we started out this whole thing of pose down, I think it was in the early 70s, and it became really the most important round. Here, for instance, is a pose of Lee Labrada starts the whole thing, then Paul comes in, and he starts posing with him. And it's like a really like trying to put your best foot forward and show off that you have better muscles than the next guy next to you. And this is what this is all about. And uh, like I said, although maybe you're behind in points, that is where you can make up points and still win in that last round. And this is why this is the round that the guys take most seriously, and this is where they put the most effort into it. And look here, looks like we have a little showdown in the pose down between Lee Labrada on the left and Paul Dillette. The bottom line here is, is to show your strong points to the judges, to bring up your strong points and to hide your weak points and to score some extra points. That's what everyone here is hoping for. Thank you. Earlier we talked with some of the competitors about what it would mean to win. Well, the Arnold Schwarzenegger Classic is uh, rapidly becoming the number one competition, both in quality and depth of field so I think it's a very substantial show uh, which I would like to win. Arnold is the highlight of my career this is the most exclusive bodybuilding title there is for me in bodybuilding um, that was putting the icing on the cake for me that's doesn't get any higher than that. Very important I mean you know of course that's why we're all here in the prize money that's involved and then it's such a prestigious contest so it's very important or else I wouldn't have put my life into it to get here. The judges have made their decision, and we're down to three competitors. And they are, on the left, Vince Taylor. In the center, Flex Wheeler, and on the right, Vince Lee Labrada. Taylor. Oh, he must be so disappointed as last year's winner to place third this year. Vince Taylor, a third place finisher, and that leaves Flex Wheeler and Lee Labrada going for the championship. Lee's wife, Robin, has seen the same scenario just...